All right, here we are again. Another checking in on my esports team to see how they're doing. We had a Zoom meeting this morning, and I did an update to the uh, roster. We had some more students join, and then I reorganized them. Right now, we have got, let's see. We've got five who want to do PvP, and we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight who want to do building and creating. Uh, and and for that, multiplayer is essential. Of course, Minecraft Education Edition multiplayer mode is unstable when we're playing from different locations. Uh, I've been requesting help from their tech support, and as I've been told, they uh, built this for use in a classroom with all the kids there on the same network. So it's, it's hard for it to uh, work consistently when we're all in different homes and, and different networks. Took a while to get in, but I'm in. One of the things I'm finding works consistently, which is what they recommend, is if you can't connect, quit out of Minecraft Education Edition, relaunch it, and let join be the first thing you do. Um, which is okay for those of us who are joining. They did recommend that those who are hosting a world uh, make the world fresh, brand new, let that be the first thing you do, and then host it. Well, that doesn't work for us, because when we're working together, we have to use a world that's already been built and worked on. Uh, but our host there, Tristan, it's been working consistently, thank goodness. And right now we've got Sarah, Logan, Brooke, Ethan, and Anya. Woo! A lot of our team is in here, which is excellent. Okay. What just happened? Um, this is strange. What is this? Come get your free salmon? Yeah, why all the lanterns? Okay, Ethan will fix. Because uh, Tristan said, I don't know. That was weird. I was... All right, well, let me get out of here. Oops. Oops. I made a hole. All right, now, how was it? There's a way to... Oh, rats. That wasn't what I meant. There's a way to copy a block so that you can um, recreate it. I learned that from a uh, Minecraft expert, Mr. Steve Isaacs from New Jersey. And uh, now I don't remember, so I made a hole there. Rats! Okay, there's a hole there too, so it looks like I'm not the only one. Because this is ridiculous. <laughs> well, tr Ethan said he was going to fix it, but can we get rid of... That's a lot of lanterns. I wonder how they did that. Did they use coding? Oops, gosh, I made another hole. I just want out. Oh my. This is quite the mess. Oh, look at that, and they're falling. Anya's agent. So I see some of my students have their agent up. Maybe they're coding. I hope so, because coding is kind of cool and uh, uses a few excellent skills of course it's coding and the best thing is you can do a lot of things a lot quicker because your agents doing all the work all right, I'm trying to get out the door so I can see what their house is looking like I don't know where I am I thought I saw the door earlier but all these lanterns. All right, I'm coming through. Oh, ooh. Mm. 
don't want to break the ones that are on the ceiling because those look nice and they illuminate this open space okay this looks familiar I've been here before I don't remember those windows okay look at me I'm lost okay I've already been here I'm almost ready to punch a hole through and ooh, oh I thought that was a uh, open spot well there's an agent what have we here maybe this goes down to their ah their basement all right I see Tristan Anya Logan and way over there is Brooks agent lava really wow okay all right so they've got a room here but I'm not seeing <laughs> what to do or where to go all right how do I get out of here is this there we go all right I'm back here again still not seeing the way out oh, what have we here another staircase all right well there's Logan oh look at that he's got his own little uh, room down here Oh, wait, that's Anya. <laughs> There's Logan. Oh, they're both here. What are they doing? I do not know what they are doing. Ooh, what is that? I don't want to break it. I'm still not that good at uh, interacting with things without breaking them. So let me see if it's a right click it interacts. If it's a left click, it's going to break it. <sighs> Alright, how did I get in here? I want out. You have to fly? That doesn't seem like the best way. But hey, whoa. Where am I? Okay. Oh, I found a door! Ooh, I really should fix that, shouldn't I? Yes, I'm out. Oh, I still wish I could remember how to duplicate a block. Let me look it up. Because I want to fix what I did. Okay, how to duplicate blocks. Minecraft. Block duplication. Nine steps. No, oh, come on. It's something uh, real quick and easy. Maybe I'm asking the wrong question. Alt F4 for single player in Java. There's bedrock. Oh. Nothing for education edition. I figure it would be the same. If it works for bedrock, why wouldn't it work for education? Yeah, I must be asking it wrong. There's a video here. Let's see if this does it. So the first thing you do is obviously find you need to get nine of the ore which you would like to duplicate. So oh, that's not what I'm asking. I, I Sorry. How else do you ask it? Oh, well. 
I'm sure all you Minecraft people are like, dummy, it's like this. All right, but let's see what kind of block that is. Is it spruce? Looks like spruce. All right, let's try it, see if that's it. What was somebody doing there? Holy cow. Ethan's removing stuff. Wow. Looks like Ethan is cleaning house. But Tristan is saying, can you stop that, please? I'm asking, what is going on? Oh dear. <laughs> All right then. Let's see. Uh oh, that doesn't look like spruce. Oh gosh, nothing like it. Now what the heck is that? Um, spruce wood stairs. What about dark oak? Kind of looks like that. Hey, where is look whoa, hey, don't close the door. whoa. Alright, well the lanterns are gone, that's cool. Huh, is that a trap door? Nope. Well somebody fixed what I did. Excellent. Wow. Alright. Well let's go back outside for the tour. I've been here all this time and just trying to get out. Okay, so We've got this tank-like thing over here, which, um, I don't know why it's there. We've got a tree house. You know, of course, when you're building your dream house, of course you have to have a tree house to play in. So they've got that. Then they've got, of course... Who wouldn't want a underground cavern? And looks like a little train set there with some rails. But let's check out their cavern. Okay, it's getting dark and I don't want to get lost. Looks like they're over there. Wow, look at them, they're all over the place. All right. But let's uh, see what the main house looks like. Oh, look at that lovely f uh, chimney. What have we here? Oh, there we go. I was wondering what that was. And they covered it up. Um, ooh, before I finish the tour, there's this over here, which I don't know what it is. Let's go in, shall we, and see what this is all about. Whoa. Why did I do that? Oh. What is this, some kind of a garage or something? Okay, well, back to the tour of the main house. So the back side, I'm assuming that's the back side, is um, just plain, no windows. Then we've got over here... Uh, a pool? A hot tub? I don't know. I can't wait till f they do the tour so I can see what uh, it's all about. Let's take a look at their roof. It's a big house. Okay. All right, let's go back in. Looks like a three-story house. And okay, they've got a fireplace here. That's where the smoke is coming from. 
very open concept. Oh, two fireplaces. But, uh, don't know what they're going to do with this. Ooh, does that open? It does! How cool is that? Oh, very nice. I didn't know you could do that. You've got a painting there. Or a tapestry. I don't know. Uh, last week, they wanted to build a uh, medieval castle. I see redstone, but it's not doing anything when I walk on it. Whoa. Okay, it's a two-story building with the uh, second floor being very huge with high ceilings. And again, these redstone uh, things there, I don't know what they're for, but I hope they do something. Make their house do stuff. Ooh, are these sinks? Oh, very nice. How'd they do that? I don't know what those are, but they look cool. <gasps> A stove. A lot of stoves. <laughs> I guess everybody can cook at once. I love the chandelier. We need more stuff on the first floor. Yes, yes you do. So Ethan, Brooke, and Anya are working in here. Whoa, ran into the chandelier. Ethan cleared the inventory of Ethan, removing 14 items. Okay, oh, there's Logan. So we got a bunch of people in here. Cool. What is this? I don't know. It looks like sinks, but I'm not sure. And then I love the windows here. You can like, oh, look at that. You can see your tree house. Very nice. And your little rail area. And it looks like we've got stairs here to go to the first floor. Now, do these open? Yes. Because I want to see what they had going in the downstairs basement area. Okay, I've already been here. And again, once you've... Ooh, what's this? You got a pool in your room or a bath... I don't know. Um, but you have to fly to get out. That, I think, is a little odd. But that's how it is now. All right, so I've seen that one. Close those doors. Let's see this one. I'm glad they put doors. Because having holes in your floor is a little weird. Oh, am I still flying? Okay. Ah, this one's better. Alright, there's Tristan. And he's got his own... Whoa. Okay, little skeleton dude. A lot of tapestries or paintings here. He's got a bunk bed. Wow. Oh, what's here? Oh, look at that. Water. Ooh. Whoops. Oh. Kind of interesting. Ha! <laughs> that was kind of cool. How do they keep the water from flowing out? And what are those bubbles? Things I don't know. Where are my... I keep typing stuff and I don't see where they are. Oh, there it is. Guess there's a lag. Yeah, since I can't 
use my uh, iPhone as a hotspot to get uh, faster uh, connection with more bandwidth, um, my internet's a bit slow. Okay. Hopefully somebody will answer that. Hey, there's those bubbles again. Where are they coming from? What's here? Oh, that's the way up. So I've got... Alright, so when you go in here, you can go in there into the... Uh, I'm going to call it a shower, because I don't know what else it is. Then you've got the stairs to go back up. Very nice. Those are stairs, so you don't have to fly. And these uh, doors on the floor. To... Hey, there's Noah. It's nice to see him able to play again. He was uh, not able to play for a while there. But he's back. All right. So this is what happened from last week to this week. We can see some changes for those who uh, tuned in last week. Why is that block floating around? Okay, that's weird. And what are these bubbles? Are they coming from me? Because I went into that shower. So yeah, I have to say, um, uh, going through, I'm enjoying seeing what they're building and, and watching them work. Uh, but in terms of uh, hosting like this, um, PvP is definitely exciting. It's non-stop, it's quick action, uh, lots to see. Whereas this is much more slow and, um, dare I say, not as exciting. Uh, like if somebody were to tune in and watch or watch this after I posted on my YouTube channel. But um, it's still wonderful. Clear up the weather. Because I know our weather here is quite nice right now, but we've got a chance of rain today. So, yeah, this is um, week two of our Minecraft COVID-19 challenge. The challenge of building a dream house or dream home. And uh, that's how Chimicum Esports, Minecraft Esports Club, is doing. Uh... They've got till May 29th to do a tour uh, on Flipgrid for the competition and share this. Uh, and it is May 12th, so they've got some time. I'm curious to see what they do. What, what, there's that block again. It's following me. Why is this block following me and attached to me? Okay, that was weird. Um, but yeah, so that's why I'm sharing this. Whoa. There's that block. The bubbles are coming out of it. There's so much I don't know about Minecraft. Um, yeah, so there's another block moving around. Is someone invisible? That's just weird. Okay, now if I had a torch, ooh, I wonder if I can put one of these down here so I can see where I'm going. <laughs> oh, look at Noah's here. What's he doing? Oh, underground pool. Is that it? That's as far as this cavern goes? Well, isn't that fun? All right, so yeah. Um, I think, oh, there we go. We've got the cart back. <laughs> That's fun. Oh. <laughs> so I'll check in. I don't know, maybe Thursday, maybe next week to see how their build is going. Uh, but otherwise, 
the team was able to meet today. I got almost all the members. A few didn't show up, um, but that's okay. Uh, these guys are on, and they're building, and that's what counts, the fact that they're getting to play together, especially during this time of quarantine when we're all stuck at home uh, without each other. So I'm going to be signing out for this week's uh, update on Chimicum Minecraft Esports, and see you all either Thursday or next week.